Hello everyone. Uh, for students who are learning Abacus methods, uh, who have started learning recently and are currently doing stage one and have already completed uh, learning and practicing the lesson one, lesson two, lesson three and lesson four. Okay, for them I am uh, specifically showing you a few sums that they could face difficulty with. This is a particular situation uh, which is which needs slightly extra attention okay it needs uh, use of two different formulas in one single calculation so please watch this carefully remember this is for those who have already understood the use of small friend as well as big friend formulas well and this particular special situation if they encounter and face a difficulty with then they can watch this video the sums that I have shown you uh, will give you a good idea of how to deal in this uh, deal with this particular situation. Okay, so the first sum is 99 plus 1, the second one is 98 plus 3, and the third one is 97 plus 5. Okay, by watching these three uh, situations, these three sums, you will get a fairly good idea of how to deal with a situation where the previous number is in the late 90s and we are supposed to add a single digit number in it okay using a particular big friend formula so let's start with the first sum the first sum is 99 plus 1 so i'll take 99 on the abacus first okay and then for adding 1 the 1 is a single digit number so i'm supposed to add that 1 on the units place rod here so for adding one, the normal uh, logic or normal concept to be used is we will have to use a big friend formula since we don't have a single bead available on the lower side here. Neither do we have the bead of five available for the use of small friend formula. So that's why we'll be making use of the big friend formula for addition of one, which is minus nine plus 10. Okay, so for doing minus nine plus 10, We'll, we can do minus 9 on this rod very easily. Okay, so minus 9 is done. But then we are supposed to add 10 on the immediate left rod. Okay, immediate left rod is this. And we are supposed to add, uh, add 10, means minus 9 plus 10. So that 1 needs to be added on this particular rod. But we don't have a single bead available here for addition as well. So again, we'll have to think of how to add 1 on this in this situation. So here we have all the nine beads used. Okay, so for addition of one on this rod, we will have to again use the big friend formula of one, which is minus nine plus 10. And we now get the answer as one zero zero, that is 100. Okay, so 99 plus one has given us 100. Please watch this again very carefully. Once you understand this part, I think the other two are fairly easy. You can, you can easy directly uh, attempt doing them. So please, watch this one carefully again this is 99 and for adding one now even if i'm adding two or three or four any such one digit number on this particular rod now the thought process is the same okay whether i'm adding one or two or three or any other one digit number the thought process will be the same for adding one on this rod i don't have a single bead available here okay both the all the lower beads as well as the upper beads have been used so in this case i will have to use the big friend formula big friend formula for addition of one is minus nine plus ten so minus nine is to be done on this rod and the plus ten that is the one is to be added on the next left rod immediate left rod so addition of one on this rod is not possible directly since all the beads have been used up uh, before so again we'll have to think of uh, how which formula to use for addition of one and again we'll have to use the big friend formula of one so it is minus nine and plus ten Okay, so 99 plus 1 gives us 100. Now let's look at the second sum. Second sum is 98 plus 3. So I'll take 98 on the abacus. And for addition of 3, I'll have to um, add 3 on this rod. That is a units place rod. For addition of 3, again, I will have to use the big friend formula because I don't have 3 beads available for addition on the lower side. And the bead of 5 is also used. So I'll have to use the big friend formula of 3, which is minus 7 plus 10. So minus 7 I will do directly. And for addition of 10, that is 1 on the next left rod, I will have to use the big friend formula of 1, which is minus 9 plus 10. So 98 plus 3 gives us the answer as 101. 
okay moving to the third sum which is 97 plus 5 so i'll take 97 on the abacus and then for addition of 5 same thought process for addition of 5 i don't have the 5 available for direct addition and 5 doesn't have a small friend at all so we'll have to use a big friend formula of 5 which is minus 5 plus 10 so minus 5 can be done here for plus 10 on the next left row we don't have a single bead available so again we'll have to use the big friend formula of 1 which is minus 9 plus 10 and 97 plus 5 gives us the answer as 102 okay so uh, this same thought process will be applicable in all situations where we are adding a one digit number in case in a uh, 90s number means a late 90s number where it cannot be added directly we don't have enough beads on the lower side to add it directly okay so the same thought process will have to be used we first think about direct addition then we think about small friend addition and then we go for big friend addition and if we need a big friend addition we need to uh, do the plus 10 part on the next left rod and if there is no space available there then we have to think of how to add that one on the tens place rod okay which formula to use okay